Today we're just going to do a short, um, well I guess it's a longer video because we're doing a Gabe's toy haul where I show you some of the cool things that you can pick up at your local Gabe's. So these are the color change LOL surprises. So you can get all different kinds of dolls. I can show you the checklist and I can show you the ones that I got today. So here's the checklist. So you can get all different kinds of dolls. I really wanted the baby next door, but I did not get her. But you can get all different kinds of dolls. You can get 12 different dolls in the set. And I got Prankster. Um, this one is Surfer Babe. I've had her before. I've had Prankster before as well. I believe I've had all these before, but I'm not sure if I still have them. Because a lot of my dolls did get damaged in a flood. So I'm not sure if I still have them. Genie. We have Merbaby. And Merbaby comes with shoes now. She didn't used to. So that's interesting. So Merbaby comes with shoes now. I guess a lot of people complained. I don't remember Merbaby used to come with shoes. I don't remember her coming with shoes originally. I don't think she did. So that's interesting. And then we have Pop Heart. Pop Heart is an ultra rare. I used to have her. I definitely used to have her. Definitely used to have Mer Baby, but I don't remember her ever coming with shoes originally. So that's something interesting. Don't think Mer Baby ever came with shoes. I don't remember her ever coming with shoes. But yeah, I think she came with something else instead. But yeah, so you get like accessories, you get like bottles. Headbands, glasses, all this different stuff. The tech out for Mer Baby. And they each come with their own little sticker with their family on it, which is really cute. So that is the LOLs that I got today. I may try some more because I do want Baby Next Door, so I may try some more on another day to see who I get. And then also Gabe's had these. These are Beach Barbies. I think these retail for five or so, but I got them for two dollars. And this one I think is either Brooklyn or Nikki. I'm not entirely sure which she's supposed to be, so don't come at me. Um, I'm not entirely sure if she's supposed to be Brooklyn or Nikki. Um, I don't mean to be racist, but I'm not sure if she's supposed to be Brooklyn or Nikki, or if she's just a generic doll. But she's very pretty. She has a purple outfit and it's like purple and pink with some butterflies on it. Very nice. And then I'm not sure if he's supposed to be um, Raj, I think, the music guy. I'm not sure. Uh, I don't think he's Steven because I think Steven had like um, a different haircut. So I think he might be Raj, the music guy. But he doesn't have his glasses. So I don't know. Or he might be just a generic guy too. I don't know. And then he's got like a... He's got like blue shorts with some palm trees on him. I like that the Kens have the removable swimsuits. Like the boys. Like this guy and Ken have a removable swimsuit. Which I do like. Like you can take this off if you want. And you can put a different outfit on him if you want to. Which I like. The girl dolls, the swimsuits are painted on. But you can put other clothes over it, but I actually like the removable swimsuit much better. So I actually prefer the Ken dolls in this kind of setup. Because you can actually remove their outfits if you want to. So I like the Ken dolls. For $2, I like the Kens. So yeah. So I got both of the Kens. I mean both of the boys, I should say. I don't think they're both called Ken. This one, I think, is definitely a Ken. Um, he's got an outfit on that's like a rainbow shorts and it says Los Angeles on it. It's pretty cute. Some of the Beach Barbies were $4 or $6. I think the blonde was $6 and the, and the Teresa one or the Hispanic was $4. I'm not sure why that is. Um, I have no idea. Some of her were $4 as well. But some of them were two. And all of the boys, I think, were 
two dollars. I don't know. So that was a little weird. I guess they have different prices because they might come from different stores. So you got to watch um, the pricing because they can vary a little bit. But they vary from two to six dollars. But I got these from two dollars. And yeah. So we have some other dolls too. This one is a Boopies. Boopies, I think it's called. Bloopies? Something like that. Um, yeah, Bloopies. <laughs> so, Bloopies. So, Bloopies um, is interesting. It's got like a pink hair with a crown. And it's kind of squeezable. It's cute. Um, yeah. And the sandals are connected for some reason. I'm guessing because it's for a younger child. But it is cute. Um, the arms do move. I think. Yeah, I think the arms move. Maybe not. Is it posable at all? I'm trying to figure that out. If this doll is posable at all. Maybe she's not really that posable. I don't know. But she's cute. And she has these flip-flops, but they're connected, like I said. And then there's the mermaid tail, which is cute. This is the mermaid tail. So you can take off the flip-flops and you can put on the mermaid tail and make her a mermaid. And she also comes with this little seahorse that you can squeeze. So this is cute. This is for a year and a half year old or and above. So it's kind of for a younger child, but I thought it was cute. So I grabbed it for $4. It's cute. I mean, it's cute. I mean, for $4, you can't really go wrong. So I grabbed it. I never had a blue piece before, so I grabbed it. And then we have the baby alive. This is a small baby alive. So this one is... A little pixie baby alive so this is a little one this is like a miniature baby alive for four dollars and she comes with a little feeding chair and a bottle and a little pet so that's really cute the pet is a surprise you don't see it until after you unbox but it's very cute so yeah not too bad so I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I'm just going to double check and see if the LOLs can use the chair for the baby alive. It looks like they can, um, but their outfits might <laughs> kind of get in the way. Let me try another one. Let's see. Maybe this one. Yeah. Well, they can, but their outfits might get in the way. So they can. Just their their plastic clothing might kind of make it difficult. But they can fit in the chair. So you can use the chair for your LOLs as well. So it's just a little much more tricky to get them in there than it is to get the baby alive in there. So... Baby Alive obviously is meant for it, but you can use um, your LOLs for the chair as well. So yeah, it's a pretty cute little chair. So it's like a little high chair for her to sit in. So yeah, um, I like these dolls, but what I did find was that it was a little... I don't know if some people find racist pricing that, that the black dolls were cheaper than uh, than the white dolls. I don't know why that is sometimes at the stores. Um, I think it just depends on where the stuff comes from, though, of Gabe's. I don't think it's intentional. But I know some stores it is intentional, so you got to watch for that. Um, some stores that is intentional. Just pointing that out there. Some stores it is intentional that they mark the black ones down. Um, that's intentional. And it's a little bit racist to do that and not mark all of them down. But, yeah. Um, so watch out for that kind of thing. Um, 
But I don't think it was racist of the store because I think they all come from different places. So the white doll, um, the white Barbie, beach Barbie may have came from a different store than this girl, which was why she was $2 and the white one was five ninety nine. But I don't know. <laughs> um, just pointing that out that, that, that I did think that was a little weird. So I didn't buy that one because obviously I don't want to spend five ninety nine on a beach Barbie or even four ninety nine. I thought two dollars was a great price and I don't really mind that she's a that she's a black doll or African American, however you wanna phrase it. It doesn't bother me at all. Um even though I'm a white person, it doesn't bother me at all. Um I love dolls of color and I think she's a great doll. Um, she's very similar to the Barbie color reveals, only she just doesn't have the paint. So this is not bad for two bucks. Um, I would have loved her to have a removable swimsuit, though, so I could redress her the way I want. But I do like her butterfly painting on her outfit. It's very pretty. So that's the reason why I got her, even though her swimsuit doesn't come off. It is pretty. So, yeah. Um... I do like that the boys, you can change them, though. That's really cool. So, yeah. Um, I hope you guys like my haul for today, and I will see you guys next time. Bye now.